Muslims pretend to be nice people. Oh, but this is so jarring to Canadian and so ears. The Westerns are very naive. You say they say that they are very uh, peaceful and love people. What the, what are you saying? Surely most naive. Muslims are. Surely most Muslims are peaceful people. Naive. You're saying every Muslim is like that? Look, every true Muslim is like that. A moderate Muslim, contemporary, polite, and the moderate. But when the Islam prevails, all of them, they will become true Muslims and follow that strategy. We know them because we live among them 14 centuries. We live among them and know them very well. But the Western people did not live with them. So they just only see the peaceful way. But one day will come and they will know the truth, but it will be too late. I'm sorry to say that. Egypt has a, a large Christian population. Egypt was home to many of the, of the church fathers and, and, and the early church. It is now, is it what, 10% Christian? Yes, Egypt? about. about. I hear terrible, terrible stories, not, th not in all of the Arab world. Uh, I know Christians from Syria and Palestine and Jordan who are not maltreated. But in Egypt in particular, I hear from Christians who tell me the most horrible stories yes. of how they're treated. Yep. Is this true? Yes, it's true. They uh, kill the people and still killing people. Um, El Kosh, a, a village in Upper Egypt. Mm -hmm. Uh, all the Christians were there were killed, but... When? When, when, when did this happen? It's in twice. Uh, in um, 1999 yeah. and in 2000. So recently, last 10 it's, years. This is the second time, you know. And uh, there are many countries. Uh, when any person go to the church and kill people there, you know, they say, oh, he is uh, mad. Mad, mad, and choose his churches and go from church to church to kill, and is mad. Every accident, they say, oh, he is a madman. Now, in in Pakistan, yeah. a small Christian community, beautiful people, uh, peaceful. There have been terrible cases of violence against Pakistani Christians. Um, in 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 Turkey, which is meant to be fairly secular, in Turkey, a Catholic priest, uh, sorry, a nun was killed, a priest too. Um, Indonesia, which is one of the, the more modern examples of Islam, uh, young Christian schoolgirls beheaded on, on their way to school. And in um, Iraq? And Iraq. in Iraq, Christians uh, since many, the many, war, many. Yeah. Uh, under Saddam Hussein, they, the Christians were not so badly treated. Yes. But since then, terrible treatment, Christians leaving the country. Yeah. When in the West, though, we say Christians are being badly treated in the Muslim world, people will, will argue, not, not only Muslims, oh, you're, you're, you're being Islamophobic. That isn't true. Yes. It is true? It's, it's very, very sad. It's very, very sad. Uh, people in the West think that Islam is a religion. So it equals Christianity as a religion. But I want to tell them that Islam is not just a religion. Islam is a state and a religion. So, Islam is ideology. Islam wants to prevail the whole world. And 9-11 uh, is not so far from us. This is their ultimate intention. <laughs> Many Muslims watching will be so hurt by what you're saying. They don't want to take over the world. They simply want to live their life, be happy and good. The, those people follow the Meccan Islam because they are weak now. But when they have the upper hand, <laughs> they will do more than that. 